Now, uh, Borderlands 2, who, who plays Borderlands? A lot of the PDX guys are here, I know you love Borderlands, I do too, yeah! Thank you, thank you very much for coming. So what we do again is we make these libraries available for game developers, and Borderlands 2 is going to be using GPU-based physics. Okay, so when you get this game, it's coming out later this year, uh, you're going to see an entirely new world that is turned real by the physics. So things like fluid simulations, smoke simulations, to break, you know, deformable fabrics, all of that is being modeled in real time on the GPU, right? So you guys want to see what this looks like? Yeah! All right, well, fortunately, the guys at Borderlands have done us a video to explain what they do for physics in Borderlands 2. So let's go ahead and cue the video on Demo 2. Borderlands 2 is a multi-platform game, but when we can upgrade to the next generation and use a GTX 680, we can do things that are just not possible on any prior generation. What's neat about the platform is they're not just amazing at rendering graphics, but they are simulation uh, CPUs, they're little simulation processors. I love just some of the simple things like physics effects, seeing hundreds and thousands of particles come out from my rockets and my, my machine guns hitting all the effects. One of my favorite things is cloth simulation. I love when soft bodies actually move the way you'd expect. Cloth blows in the wind. Uh, when I shoot it, I pierce little tiny holes and I can actually tear apart things and it rips apart and simulates the way you'd expect something to in real life. Something as simple as fluid dynamics. A pool of, of water with you know water spewing into it, you can see that it's simulating in real time. And, and now when I step into that water, you can see that I can push the water around with my body and throw a grenade in there and it blasts out. And this is only possible with this amazing GTX 680. At Gearbox, every one of our developers is using NVIDIA hardware in our development PCs. When we create the vision, this is, this is the way we see it, using next generation hardware, like the GTX 680. And if you want to see the game the way we see it, you should use the same hardware.